to week three of Sunday Share and Care. I hope you've had a really good week. This week, what I want to talk about is moving again in the area of compassion. I'm really talking about love and self-love and that self-love is in fact selfless. When we treat ourselves better, when we're kinder to ourselves, the wonderful effect is that this reaches out to others and we tend to be kinder, more patient, more patient and more compassionate to others also. So what I'd like you to look at this week is the idea of self-love and as Oscar Wilde said, to love oneself is the beginning of a lifelong love affair. The relationship that we have with ourselves is so important. To really love yourself, to wake up in the mornings and feel like that you're with somebody that you want to be with. Because let's face it, you're there every moment of your life when you wake up and when you go to bed at night. So it might as well be a good and strong and positive relationship. A way to cultivate this and a way to really work on this relationship is to do some mirror work. So I'm going to suggest over the next seven days that if you are feeling that relationship needs work, a really good way to build on it, to build on trust and rapport and love, is to basically to look in the mirror and to make really good eye contact with yourself. Even just sustaining eye contact with yourself is a way of building up trust. And what I'd like you to do is to do three simple sentences, to say three simple sentences to yourself. And the first one is, looking in the mirror, is to say, I trust you. Just simply looking beyond everything without judgment, without looking at whether your hair or your makeup or your clothes or whatever it is, but just to look and into your own eyes and to say, I trust you. I accept you. And I love you unconditionally. Now those three sentences, when you really are consistently saying them to yourselves, to yourself, it can be very, very powerful. And this shift can start to happen where you look at yourself with such a sense of love and contentment and inner peace. And who doesn't want that? So this Sunday, I really do hope you have a great day, a great week. The Positive Habit is continuing to receive wonderful reviews. One client even said that the course should be mandatory because it's helped her so much in her life. So please do log on to thepositivehabit.com if you do need further help. And in the meantime, you can be getting yourself mentally fit for Christmas. And this is a great way to do it. It's a six week course. So it's a really good time now to think about that. So you're strong and resilient for Christmas because it can be a time where people, there's emotions and family issues, etc. So I will see you next week, same time, same place. Have a great week and please do like, share, care and subscribe to this video.